Hello everybody and welcome back to your favourite FC24 series on YouTube, it's Big Goalkeeper episode 54. And as you can see we have a massive decision to make, do we stay at FC Augsburg or do we make the decision to switch to a different team? We have some big names, Dortmund, Leverkusen, Hoffenheim, a lot in Germany, Juventus, Monaco, Chelsea and West Ham. And I think there's only one choice really to make here, I think it has to be Chelsea and you know why? Because I want the money. Give me all the money you can. Here comes the money. Why is the goalkeeper kit always yellow though? Every team I've played for this series has been yellow. It's so annoying, but I have to deal with it. Also change the boots and gloves because we are sponsored by Nike now. So a bit of a matching theme going on. Bit of blue, bit of blue, bit of blue. But also looking at the team. We have a bit of competition, 85 rated, the Italian goalkeeper there. The overall team is not too bad, some superstars, Fernandez 89 rated, and Cuckoo's up there, Chigaweki, and I think Palmer's in the team as well. But before we get into this first match, remember to leave a like on this vid, let's try to get to 100 for a new move. Subscribe if you're new, and turn the fish on so you don't miss a thing. Let's get into it. First match is an international friendly match against Inter Milan. We come on as a substitute, obviously. The game's all tied up, but we get a great opportunity. We could have got in the lead. The keeper makes a pretty decent save. 82nd minute with Casado on the ball into our right mid. I need to learn everyone's position, but I think it's Fofana gets past the centre back now. One of the goalkeeper hits it straight at him. What is he doing? And that is the match done and dusted. All tied up. No shots against for me, I don't know why Silva's having a go at me, I did nothing, I just stood there for about half an hour, one shot, didn't even hit, get on target, 5.4 rating, next match is against Bayern Munich, this is a stacked cup, or international friendly cup, whatever you want to call it, coming on again as a substitute because we can't build a rating up, because we don't get enough time, but early on I'm dealing with the ball, I get snapped there by Musiala, referee gives the foul, very lucky for me, he literally crunches me for no reason, leave it out sunshine, you're not that big dog, I'm the big dog here, but look at this challenge, actually filthy, look at that, through the back of me, why does he not get a yellow card there, now only 7 minutes left of the match, we're down the left side of the pitch, beautiful ball, in behind the defensive line now, pass it across, again, one twosie, one of the goalkeeper, keeper makes the save, out for the corner, and the match ends again, nil, nil this time, maybe it's a mistake joining Chelsea, we can't score, to save anyone's life here, no shots against me either, but we move on to the next match, which is against Napoli this time, three massive teams we've played against, can we make at least one type of save, coming on, game all tied up, nil, nil, 60th minute, Napoli get the first opportunity, takes a shot at me, <laughs> finally, making my first save for Chelsea, it's a nice easy one, they plucked it out of the sky, but Napoli is still putting us on a bit of pressure there towards our byline line, gets past my defender, one on one of me, takes a shot straight at me, and I gather up the rebound as well, great goalkeeping in in the end, seven minutes left, we're into the penalty box, left side now, it takes time to cross it to the back stick, wins the header, it's straight at the goalkeeper. Not good enough! Now only a minute left of this match, we've got a bit of space just outside the box, I keep running, running, no one put him under pressure, add to left foot, it's short, keeper gets a fingertip, push it out for the corner, I decide to get involved because why not, I'm just inside the penalty box, waiting for the pass, we're playing around, time's ticking, but into me, left foot strike and whiff it straight past the post, and we draw that match as well, nil, nil, we are yet to see a goal which is crazy two shots against or three shots against two saves now just before the beginning of the season i'm in the starting 11 <laughs> still missing my legs though so she's probably get that checked out but whatever we'll carry on playing anyway walk out of the gym getting on to that bus and here we are we're first matches against west ham away from home the team that i could have joined let's see if it was a mistake joining chelsea or maybe it's the right choice in the end they get the kick off and we get the first opportunity, right side of the pitch towards that byline, holding off the defender a little bit, trying to make some space, does actually find Casada there, who holds off the defender as well, wiggles past him, and the other defender hits the shot and finds the back of the net, 13 minutes in, what has gone on there, it's Ramsdale in goal, but look at the strength of my man, holds off for everyone, little ball roll and smashes out of the near post for Ramsdale, no wonder Arsenal soldier, if you're trying to make save that they're actually atrocious. West Ham trying to get back into the game, whip the ball back post, and my defender somehow keeps the ball out. Look at this, actually made of like concrete or something. Takes a shot to the head, definitely has concussion. Look at him, bang, hits the floor as well. He is not okay after that one. He is absolutely suffering. Look at his face. 
Either way, he has to walk it off and he gets half time to make a little bit of a recovery. 1-0 to us. Into the second half we go. Can we hold on to this clean sheet? What a lovely way to make my proper debut with full clean sheet. But they are trying to get back in this game. They're down the right side this time. Hugging that byline. Whips it to the middle. It's a header. And look at that for a save. It's a beauty. Proper good save. Ball's just floated. It looks at run from Flahovic. Gets the header. Wanted it more. Good hand. Look at little double save there. Or double movement, I should say. Brilliant. And now something funky happens to Enzo. What is going on with this game? Help me. All over the place. All sorts of movement. I'm not quite sure you're going to walk off after that one. It's actually ridiculous. This game is so, so broken. This was just randomly. It's like, oh, look at the twist in that. Doesn't make any sense. If he doesn't have pull a muscle from somehow, I don't know what's going on. Either way, hopefully it doesn't affect him too much because I want to win the game. 67th minute into the midfield. We go a little flick for no reason. Just playing around, trying to make a bit of space. Ball's laid off to Hernandez. Hits the first time and bangs it past the goalkeeper. Maybe he got abducted by aliens at some point. What is going on? Twist and pulse and bangs that ball past the goalkeeper. Actually, screamer. Love to see it. Laid off perfectly and runs perfectly. Bang! Past Ramsdale. No chance at all. 2-0 up in this match, in this London derby, and we do go on to win it. It was the right choice joining Chelsea over West Ham. Brilliant stuff. 7.1 rating. Only the one save, apparently. Even though I'm pretty sure I made two. Ramsdale, Howler. Two shots against no saves at all. And now we move on to another one. Little bonus game for you against Burnley this time. At home, first time stepping foot onto Stamford Bridge's turf. We get the kickoff. Can we get a goal early on this match? 10 minutes in. Balls played across the pitch into Mudrick. A little back off for no reason. Ball played in. One of the goalkeeper. Yeah, quickly, but it hits the wrong side of the net. Unlucky, but probably should have taken a better touch. Didn't get pushed out too wide, but now we've got Mudrick running. Plays a lovely ball into feet. We've got men over. Fofana takes a shot and finds the back of that little finesse. And the keeper probably has the worst animation I think I've ever seen. Ball drilled into the feet there. Lays it across. There's a man over as well. And Kuka it was, but Fofana decided to go on his own and finesse it past the goalkeeper who did a weird animation but we're 1-0 up just before half time now Burnley get the first three whip it towards back post with the header and get the goal and I'm very very frustrated with this one because they're toxic as well look at that just stand in my net but I feel like I should have saved it I went the right way did the save or did the animation for the save and it felt wrong do you know what I mean it felt very very wrong ball is a decent one out jumps my defender I'm, I'm there it's so annoying when you think you do everything right and the game just doesn't give you a little bit of luck you need powers it down but I'm literally so close to making it you see from this angle here heads it down I'm literally pop into the animation and if you look at the gloves here they actually move which is really suspicious to me but the goal goes in it's all tied up and they're trying to get into lead just for half time now down the same side into the box takes a shot over oh! killed a fan of that type of shot but that's the half time whistle blown all tied up 1-1 one, one. I feel like this is going to be a struggle. Burnley tend to be very defensive at counter-attack. I think we're going to have trouble breaking it down, but hopefully we don't. 53rd minute, little flick for no reason. Takes a shot early. Keeper sprawls across the line with a decent little save there. 58th minute, down the right side, trying to work our way back into the box. Enzo on the ball, waits a full of pass, finds the man. One of the goalkeeper takes stuff wide, takes a shot anyway. Keeper moved a save, and then... <laughs> I get subbed off. I can't believe it. 4.9 rating. I did all right. That goal was ridiculous. But we do go on to win the match. 2-1. Only two chances. Absolute clinical. And Cuckoo, 84th minute. But look at the player stats. We're at the top for the clean sheets. 1-2. and two, Along with Castile, Saar, Alisson and Andrew from Brentford. Alisson's still at Liverpool there. And obviously I'm at the top of Chelsea. Assist. Grealish from Man City. 2-2. Two and two. Odegaard, 2-2. Two and two. Do we have anyone for Chelsea there? And Cuckoo, 1-2. and two. A few, Quite a few matches tonight. Play there a few Tottenham as well but top goal scores Rashford for United two in one match Ferreira for Chris Pass two and two Xerxes Everton and Hoyland Arsenal do we have anyone of course we don't why would we but that's gonna be it for today's episode I hope you'd enjoy if you did don't forget to leave a like on the video really like my channel subscribe if you're new and turn the notifications on so you don't miss a thing and as always look after yourself stay safe and I'll speak to you next time goodbye